With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Let's start the question. The question has an assertion and reasoning. Assertion says that no engine can have efficiency greater than that of Carnot engine. And reason says that efficiency of Carnot engine is given by eta is equal to 1 minus d2 by t1. So if I am looking at the assertion, assertion talks about the Carnot's theorem. So what does Carnot's theorem say? Carnot's theorem says that no engine can have an efficiency greater than a Carnot engine which is an ideal engine wherein complete conversion of heat is done to work such that efficiency is 100%. And the reason says that Efficiency of a Carnot engine is given by eta is equal to 1 minus d2 by d1. We know that e efficiency is given by work done divided by heat absorbed. So efficiency, uh, I mean work done can be written as if you have a heat engine. So if this is my engine, so this is a sink source at higher temperature t1. This is a sink at lower temperature t2. Then, so this is source. This is sink. So it absorbs some heat energy, right? It gives out some heat energy and the remaining it will be using it in work. So if Q1 is absorbed and Q2 is rejected, so we know that from this Q1 is equal to Q2 plus W from the above expression from the heat engine uh, theorem. So Q1 is equal to Q2 plus W. So W is nothing but Q1 minus Q2. So this will be heat absorbed Q1. So eta will now be nothing but Q1 minus Q2 divided by Q1 which is nothing but 1 minus Q2 by Q1. So the heat energy which is rejected to the temperature will be at temperature T2 and this will be at temperature T1 by Carnot's theorem by deriving the Carnot cycle. So our efficiency expression will become 1 minus T2 by T1 where T2 is the sink temperature and T1 is the source temperature. So if we are looking at the assertion and reason again, assertion is true individually, reason is true individually but re reason is not explaining the assertion. So our correct option is going to be option 2. Both assertion and reason are true but reason does not explain the assertion. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.